What's going on, YouTube? This is the Neighborhood DraftKings Attic, and today I'm bringing my top picks for Tuesday's main MLB slate. All right, guys, so if you're new to the channel, guys, uh, I love me some DFS. All right, it's over, but MLB is a very long season, guys, so uh, I try to put out a video a week, but uh, sometimes it may be three videos, sometimes it may be five. But um, if you like the channel, go ahead and hit that thumbs up, guys. If you want to see more videos, comment below. Uh, let me know what's going on, guys. But, again, MLB is a very long season, a lot of variance, and, uh, you know, a lot of things go right, a lot of things go wrong. But let's break it down. So today you got my top plays on the board, guys, 14-game slate. You got a lot of ways to go. Um, I would go ahead and uh, find out which games you like, target the pitchers who are giving up the most uh, as far as hits and uh, hard contact, and try to target those players that can take advantage of it and get some dongs, man, because at the end of the day, Home runs rule on MLB. All right, so on the screen, you got Lance McCullers, guys. I'm going with the discount at 11.3K. Last time he played this team, he put up 32 DraftKings points, which is great for 11K. You know, I know we got Kluber on the uh, on the slate versus Milwaukee. All right, but he's 13.6, guys, almost 2K more, man. I don't know if I want to play it. But, hey, for cash games, maybe that's what you want to do. But that's a lot that you're sacrificing, guys. You're going to have to find some value bets. All right. But I'm going with my man McCullers. All right, next up, got to give me some of this Colorado game. I like Ian Desmond. At the moment, I see that he is slated to bat leadoff. If he's batting leadoff, I'm probably going to have him in almost every line. I'm just saying. Now, you see his average is 1.88, but he hits. He has six home runs on the season. In the last game he played, he put up 28 DraftKings points versus the Mets, guys. So as you can see, this guy's a hit or miss, guys. But... If he's batting leadoff, I like his chances because he'll get at least four chances at the ball. All right. Next up, Cesar Hernandez. I like this Philly game. So last game he played, you see, they put up 11 runs. He had three at-bats, had two runs, uh, had a stolen base. So I like Cesar Hernandez. He's batting leadoff. So that means he's going to get a couple opportunities to hit the ball. And if he gets on base, I like his stolen base upside. So he's batting uh Point three six two over at the moment, so I like his chances of getting on. Trevor Story again. I got to get some more of this Colorado game, man. Uh, Arenado is kind of expensive. I may pay up for him depending on how the slate breaks down as the day goes on. But Trevor Story is a cheap way to get into that uh, offense in Colorado. He has seven home runs on the season, and uh, looking at his numbers, he is definitely uh, a player you want to try to get a dome from. So. He's hitting a .255 ISO, all right, versus lefties and a .373 Woba. So I like his chances of knocking one off the park, if not getting a couple of RBIs. All right, Janikowski is a is a value play, guys. All right, look at this guy's track record. The last three games, he's putting up double digit DraftKings points. He's hitting the ball. He's still in bases, and he's he's not king a lot. So he's getting on, and I like his chances. In this matchup, Johnny Kelsey has a uh, .328 Woba, um, and he has stolen base upside. But I like him for 3K. Hoskins, this guy's playing a lefty. I'm just going to play him. Okay, this guy has a, has the ability to put the ball out the park. So I'm going with Hoskins in this Philly game. I believe they're projected to have around five runs, and I want to get some of that. All right, so at 4.9K, he gives you nice upside. Again, he has a .297 ISO and a .413 Woba. So he has a chance to put up some nice points today. So Mazzara, I want some of his Texas game. All right, in Texas. Last game, he put up 21. He had a home run. And um, he has eight home runs on the year. But Mazzara, he's batting a .208 ISO and a .353 uh, Woba. And again, five implied runs in this game. So it should be a... Pretty nice high scoring game, and he's in the middle of that, uh, in the meat of that order. And I like his chances of putting up a double digit DraftKings points. So, all right, guys, good luck on today's 14 game slate, short and sweet. And so, for those of you who stay to the end, I got a couple of treats for you. So, Draft Dashboard is an app that I use to research my MLB. As you can see, Adrian Gonzalez right here is uh, graded pretty high, but I don't want to chase those points because he put up a double dog yesterday, but he's in a good spot again today. Long story short, check out this app. There's a link in the description of this video. If you go through the link in the description of the video, you get a seven-day trial for one buck. All right, another one. Follow me on Twitter. 
Twitter handle is in the description of this video. Today, I will tweet out my cash lineup. So thank you for following to the end of the video. See you guys next time.